Hi everyone, this is Jaylene, and I have an update for you on the energies that we're experiencing right now, as well as an announcement. This Monday, we have our spring equinox, and it's going to occur at about 2.30 p.m. Pacific time. And at 4.30, I'm going to be offering a YouTube live meditation where we can all connect and work with the energies of the equinox. This is a massive energy event we're about to go through. And the reason I'm posting this energy update right now is because of the incredible opportunity we as a human race have uh, during this equinox. So right now we have tremendously high frequency energy on the planet. It's coming in as photonic light from the cosmos and it's being emitted from the earth because as she's accelerating in her ascension, the relative frequency of the earth is going up as well as you may have noticed if you've been paying attention that there's been a drop in the magnetic field around the earth. And what this means as is that there's less cushion buffer or protection in the energy field between us and the frequencies of the earth. So everything that we're experiencing that's coming in this photonic light and everything that earth is emitting right now, as she expands into more freedom and more accelerated evolution we are feeling very, very acutely within our bodies. Our DNA is responding to these changes because your DNA is so adaptable, it wants to shift and change with the energies around it. So what this means for us and this very special event that's happening on the equinox is that what does the equinox mean? It's, it's the equality of the light and the dark. And this couldn't be more true for what is going on right now. This high frequency energy is basically pulling forward all of the experiences that our soul has ever had. Your soul is vast, it's infinite. And so all of the energies of all the lifetimes you have lived and your soul is experiencing timelessness, right? We here in the third dimension experience time in a linear pattern, in a linear fashion, but your soul does not. It's outside of time. And so everything's happening in the now moment. So it could be future lives from your perspective, past lives, things that are happening in this current lifetime, anything that has occurred to you that you have placed in judgment of being either good or bad is coming up for you to bring into integration within your energy field. Because what a high frequency does is that it no longer sees things as polarities. It no longer deals with things as good, bad, light, and dark. Everything becomes amalgamized. Everything becomes one frequency of experience. And that experience accelerates your evolution as a soul. And the acceleration pattern is moving you back into a state of oneness with source. So right now, we are being called to step into higher states of integration, higher states of understanding ourselves as expressions of source energy, as expressions of oneness. So you can't do that without integration. And integration can occur unless you start to accept all aspects of self. So this is deep shadow work that's going on right now. And it's also deep acknowledgement work, acknowledging the aspects of you that are very high frequency that are love and light, as well as accepting all aspects of you that you might've been trying to hide away that you're not proud of. Or maybe you're just feeling something within your physical being right now that doesn't feel quite right. You can't quite put your finger on it. Those are probably experiences from your soul that, is, that are coming forward right now in this high frequency that want to be brought into acceptance and love. I've been working with a new council of light beings, ascended masters. They're beautiful divine feminine beings. And they're going to be sharing their energies with us during the meditation on Monday evening. And so I look forward to bringing forward some messages from them and sharing those with you and doing a meditation that really they're helping me to craft that will bring our energy fields into a place of neutrality and equilibration with all aspects of self so that your DNA can vibrate at a higher frequency and that you can continue to accelerate your evolution and movement back to source. So I look forward to seeing you on Monday. Thanks for listening and be well with your integration. Do what you can to meditate, to connect to your soul, 
and to accept all aspects of yourself with love and compassion. See you soon. Goodbye for now.